there are times when it looks like. Nothing is working when it looks like. You are searching for answers that no one can provide. You have prayed, you have cried, you have. Sought for counsel, you have even give up. It looks like you have done all that you know to do yet. It doesn't seem like God is answering. Your blessings are coming. When you feel a trial come your way, the best thing you can do is to get down on. Your knees and pray, Lord, made of divine, will be done in all things I submit, fully to whatever you desire. Our Christian witness is authentic when it is faithful and unconditional. It looks as if God has turned his back on you. No one is seeing your efforts no matter. How hard you try and you are wondering why. God is saying everything will work out. I am in complete control. Hear me clearly. I will not fail you. Only one God, only one way, only one, Savior Jesus. You cannot break a woman who seeks her happiness from God. Jesus carry our sins so we wouldn't have to thank you, Lord. But it's got really overlooking you. Let's find out from his answer to Zion. Isaiah chapter 49 verse 15 says, Can a woman forget a sucking child that she should not have compassion on the son of a home? Yeah, they may forget yet, will I not? Forget thee, so if God isn't forgetting. You then what exactly is happening? The answer is God is looking for a perfect opportunity to exit your expectations. Jesus doesn't ask you to carry the heavy cross with him, just a small piece. We cannot trust in our own strength, but only in Jesus and his mercy. God hasn't failed to notice you, he sees you. As you keep pushing and streaming to please him, he is preparing the right. Opportunities for you. Never give up on God and what he has promised you. When God finally comes through for you, you won't be able to believe everything he will give you. God doesn't just prepare the right. Opportunities he also prepares you to be fit enough to be where he has called you to be. One reason it does this is that God is a dust God. The money is coming, the new home is coming, the new job is coming, the breakthrough is coming, the new car is coming. He own unfairly put an incompetent person in a place and make other people suffer so it trains you to be worthy of your calling. If you are faithful where you are, Currently our God will keep bringing you opportunities to move to another level. Before you enter any new level God must prepare you for that level. The season of preparation is often a long phase that God passes you through. This is the stage that God begins to make and mold you into who you should be. This phase is different for everyone because we are all unique. We are all called to handle a specific problem in the world today. We all have a uniquely different assignment. All you need to do is put your trust in me and work hard. I will place the right. People along your path, I have watched over you and will always watch over you. Believe my words, you have done your all parts. Now is my time to show you my miracles. You will be surprised and shine like star everywhere. So if you are supposed to be a doctor, you will be trained different from an engineer. Even amongst other doctors, God will still make sure there is someone distinct about your life. This is why he says we are carefully and wonderfully made. Anything that isn't unique isn't really wonderful, it's normal. So we must always strive to be where God wants us to be by preparation. Eventually God will show you who you really are as you commit yourself to preparation. The good health is coming the new. Business is coming, the financial freedom is coming, the love is coming. A woman who is okay with being alone is a powerful woman. Do you believe God can do the impossible in your life? God will always bring the right opportunity to exit your expectations. For example, Joseph just wanted to leave the present, so he told the cupbearer to remember him and say to Para that he is innocent. But what God wanted was for Joseph to become the prime minister in Egypt. And because Joseph was prepared, God exited his expectations. God says your eyes will be full of tears with love. Keep the feeling in the mind. 
that Jesus Christ knows everything and surrender to him, then see what happens in 24 hours. Message of the day you don't need to worry about the next step in your life. Whenever you feel like God has forsaken, you remember that he say he will never leave you nor forsake you. It is just preparing you. I hope you enjoyed this video. God bless you.